Kurt, the cyber guy, joins us live. Good morning to you. Hey, good morning to you. This is never before seen proof that indeed everything you write, email, text, communicate on any electronic right. device is indeed recorded and watched by the U.S. government. Where do they keep it? All right, well, NSA is really good at this. Okay, and, you know, and, we, and we like this law because back after 7, uh, September 11, right. uh, Section 702 of the FISA Act, what it did was it enabled our government to go in without a warrant and, and go after terrorists that could be on U.S. soil communicating to do another attack against us. So right. we said, let's get them, right? Well, today, years later, we're seeing now not only proof, but actually a report from the U.S. government that came out on Friday, and you know that's the day they want to take out the trash so that sure. people don't notice. Talk well, we that. noticed. And so what it is is a report saying that these 3.4 million searches happened. Now, they many of them were involving international parties, but you and I could be swept up in them just because we're plain Americans and may right. have some loose connection. Right, because somebody who might be involved might have called you at some point or might have texted you and suddenly you're part of it as well. Or a search could involve a term right. that they saw in some international concern that you and I could be talking about Disney, for example, and then boom, that could be the term that they're looking for. And now they have combed out our family's data or your own personal data. Well, speaking of Disney, the perfect transition. So this family from Tennessee, uh, somebody's looking at their, uh, the 17 year old daughter is looking at her iPhone and she realized, wait a minute, somebody is tracking me. The whole day they're at Disney World, they're having a great time. They're on the monorail going back to their car. They get to the parking lot and on the monorail though, they notice on their phone indeed, an Apple AirTag had been tracking them. One of their phones went off. It automatically comes up if on you, Apple products. If you've got an Apple, if you've got an iPhone, you're in good shape. If you've got an Android, kind of tough. You have to proactively download mm -hmm. an app. It is available, but it's still a tough thing. Uh, they get to their car, they're shaking out their clothes, trying to figure out where is this thing? Because you can hear it beeping. And at the same time, it says on your phone that it's right there, and it shows a map of all the places they went at Disney, so, and they've been followed. So does it sound like somebody dropped it into their purse or something like that? It happens quite frequently, normally targeted to a lot of younger females who are out later, and it gets slipped into someone's pocket or in their handbag, and it's this tiny. Hold so this up. is exactly how you could possibly get That's found an out. Air tag. That is an Apple AirTag, a little bit larger than a quarter. And it is so easy to slip into somebody's bag, their pocket, uh, into a shoe, yeah. into the back of a car. One of my kids, it was in one of their bags. Right. Did so, not belong to them. Right. There is a way to detect this. If you do have an Android, I'll show you how to do it online and how to detect air tags when it'll go off if someone ever does this to you. Right. And then also, if you, if you, are, if you have an iPhone, it's good to be aware of if this ever happens to you, and it's happening more often than ever, right. how, to, how to notice it. And there's pressure on Apple to discontinue that product because of personal safety. You know, that's the extreme reaction to it, but you have to say like right now, for Mother's Day, it's 29 bucks, redo mom's keys. There's no harm in that. It's a great tool right. for finding stuff that you lose, but it's a dangerous tool when put into the wrong hands, just Absolutely. like anything in life. All right, more information, go to cyberguide.com because he's got all that stuff right there. Thank you. Cyber guy, thank you very much. Good to see you.